Hello, this is my idea for a very compact one minute timer using 13W37A snapshot features. Now, this is three blocks long, two tall, and one wide because of the button. Now, the despawn time for the arrow entity is exactly one minute. So every time the arrow despawns, it releases the bucket button then this redstone torch can turn on and it summons an arrow right halfway through this block red the button so this can also be modified where the man block is there so that it's only one tall instead of two but it'll be four long um, so you can see that, uh, how it works and it has to be a wooden button because arrows can only trigger wooden buttons and not stone buttons. Now this is a slightly modified that adds a timer to see how long someone's been playing just to show one of the many uses for this. So you can see on the sidebar on the right it shows how long I've spent playing. So every one minute it adds a minute to the timer. It's very compact. Now here I have an idea for a wireless redstone using the set block command which places a redstone block right here when I press this button. And one of the problems with this is that uh, the arrow will always spawn facing south, so this device must be made facing south. Which you can use by hitting F3 and looking at the bug screen. Now here I have combined both of the features to create a 4 minute timer. It's still very compact and so how it works is whenever this triggers and does a 1, the, uh, it's the same system as over there but the command box is in a different position and it has a delay. Every time that happens, it uh, uh, when the button is released, these repeaters turn off, which unlocks the these repeaters so the charge can pass through, and they lock again after it's passed through one repeater. So when this one's powered, it, it uh, sets a redstone block at this position, and so it stays there until the repeaters are released, and the charge passes through here, and it sets an air block right there, destroying the redstone block. If we wait long enough, you'll be able to see how it works. Mm. I think it's very compact, and a lot of people will be able to use these kind of compact one minute clocks to uh, make adventure maps or use them for lots of features. But this is just one small example. Of but you can do, do lots of stuff with this. Okay, thanks for watching.